All right, so let's explore quickly SAS uh, Meta. So usually the functions provided by Meta, they will never be used uh, when you are building a style sheet. They are valuable only for de debugging purposes or if you want to check that if something is not working properly. So we will just quickly go uh, through these that what are these and you would understand from the names and their functionality as well that they are purely from the debugging perspective here. Yeah. So the first one call and function comma argument. So you can call a function with the arguments and returns the result. Yeah, if you want to check what like, you know, rather than before you use that function in your style sheet and while you're debugging. So uh, you just want to check that what the function is, how it is working and what is the well, what it is returning. Uh, so there you can use it. Uh, content exists. So this would check whether the current mixin was passed uh, at content block. Now we haven't used this at content block earlier uh, well, when, when we check the mixins, but let's quickly um, have a look at exactly what it is. And if I explain it, it's a bit complicated. So I have opened up the definition of it for you uh, on, this, uh, on, on the SAS uh, language website. So uh, in addition to taking arguments, a mixin can take an entire block of styles known as a content block. All right. So what 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 happens actually? Let's have a look in the example what they have given. It's a very good one. So we are uh, when we are defining the mixin, yeah, uh, and we the name of this is hover, and we want uh, for this particular selector to have a block which we we're just we're not defining any styles here we're just saying add content that means that this is a placeholder something is going to come here wherever we want to use it yeah so now we are using this we are including this mixin over here at include hover so what would happen first of all the selector would be uh, dot button and then not disabled hover yeah and we can see dot button not disabled hover now whatever the styles we would define here so those would be placed in here yeah so um, it's, a, it's, it's a bit you know looking at things on the, uh, the other way but usually you know we would write our styles at the time of defining the mixin when we are writing the mixin you know there we, we we are used to writing the styles yeah but if at all you don't know that you know what styles you want to write at the time of writing and you want to have those with the help of mixin when you are writing your style sheet so i really don't know like you know, why it is like this you know now we can have it but if you if, if you really want to use it and there is any i didn't come across where i had to use it even if when i was doing the, when i'm doing the projects but yeah it is there for you so back to uh, our meta functions then we can check that whether a feature exists uh, like uh, if you want to check like kind of at error uh, whatever the version of SAS you are using and if you want to check any certain feature so with this one with this function you can um, you can do that function exists so if you want to check any name of the function that whether it is defined somewhere in your style sheet and you have a very big project and uh, you, you want to see so you can check it with the help of this this uh, function get function yeah so it would return the specified function if the css is true it returns a plain css function instead uh, global variable exists again as evident from the name that to check whether the specified global variable is there in your sheet or not inspect the value it would return a string representation of a value mixing ex Mixin exists, so again, uh, you want to check if certain mixin is there or not. Type of value, uh, whether it's a number, color, list, map, boolean, it's a null, or it's a function, or it's an argument list, so you can check that. 15 pixel would give you number, and if you pass the hex representation of a color, so of course, it would give you the type of that as color. Unit number, you can check the units of uh, 
of, of, of whatever the value you're passing to 15 pixel of course would return you pixels unit less yeah number and you want to check whether there are units or not variable exists yeah so it would check whether this the specified variable is available in the current scope or not so mainly related to the scoping and if you are using some variable uh, knowing or, or assuming that uh, the variable is available within the scope or maybe that is local to another block of the code and you are trying to use it somewhere where it doesn't exist and you want uh, to debug or to, 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 to have some error checking or some condition uh, or some decision depending upon that so there you can use variable exist yeah so that's it for sas meta function uh, functions yeah so thank you so much for being with me and i'll see you in the next one